I'm Henrietta McNeil. I'm a PhD candidate in the Department of Pacific Affairs at the ANU. My research is about how the securitisation of identity plays out in the criminal deportation and reintegration process in the Pacific. I look at criminal deportations from Australia, New Zealand and the US to Pacific states. On the deporting side, I look at who gets deported and why they get deported. What are the laws and discourses that surround this? On the receiving side, I look at the reintegration in Pacific states, so what approaches are taken? Are returnees accepted back into society? What challenges might they face? And ultimately, what does this mean for regional security? I guess I see the trend of deportation as not really stopping from Western states. So it's relevant to look at this issue now and see what can be done. What can be done prior to deportation to assist with reintegration? Does that include opportunities for language learning while incarcerated? Or does it involve more information and resources to be provided to Pacific Islands to support reintegration? Ultimately, I think we have to understand that reintegration is going to be different in each state. And we have to acknowledge that good practice won't be a one-size-fits-all. What I want is for my PhD to contribute to good policy making around reintegration approaches and what's best for Pacific states.